A former Republican state senator announces he will file as an independent in his bid to unseat Governor Kevin Stitt from the governor's office. This is the second announcement in a couple of weeks of GOP members leaving the party in the gubernatorial race. News 9's Augusta McDonald is live at the state capitol now with more. Augusta? Kelly, Amanda, I sat down with Dr. Irvin Yen today and he told me he's leaving the party because he doesn't feel the Oklahoma GOP represents his values anymore. He said he's running to bring better health care policy to Oklahoma. You have to be against vaccine mandates. And then at a national level, of course, you hear the Republican Party keep saying that Trump won the election. Right. And, and especially the politicians are saying that. Now, do the voters, the Republican voters across the country really believe that? Surely not. That's the question. Will voters follow their former GOP leaders and change their vote in 2022? Political analyst Scott Mitchell says it's just too soon to tell. There is upheaval inside the Republican Party. There's the Republican Party, the old standard Reagan uh, wing of the party. And those folks are not what you would call the standard uh, Trump version of the party. Two weeks ago, Superintendent of Public Instruction Joy Hoffmeister made a similar move in her announcement to run for governor as a Democrat, bucking her lifelong Republican affiliation. Like a Republican. Dr. Yen plans to run on a health care forward platform. I am all about health care, okay? And I, I believe our current governor has, has failed miserably when it comes to health care, especially COVID. Dr. Yen told me that he watched hospitals suffer from the inside during the pandemic, and now he feels like this is his chance to do something for Oklahoma. At the Capitol, Augusta McDonald, Oklahoma's own News 9.